the insane technology behind Starlink. Hey people, welcome back to Success Tank. The amazing Starlink technology has fulfilled everyone's dream of being able to access the internet fully. No matter where you live, amazing technology can provide you with the services wherever you want. It has some advanced features that have overwhelmed everyone. We got a Starlink beta kit. That's right, internet from the stars, baby. Pew, pew, pew. Here is the insane technology behind Starlink. But before we begin, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos. 5. Engineers A group of SpaceX software engineers who hold various leadership positions in the Starlink team gave a deep look into the jaw-dropping software that runs on the Starlink network and discussed everything from Starship to Starlink to working at SpaceX. The technology used by the company is amazing. However, it was not easy for the SpaceX team to put updates out to an entire constellation of satellites. Natalie is in charge of the software test infrastructure for Starlink satellites. She went ahead elaborating on the entire software process. She gave out a statement in which she said that SpaceX tries to roll out new software builds to its entire fleet of assets which includes ground station and user terminals, Wi-Fi terminals, and satellite routers at least once per week. 4. Software Every device is periodically checked in with SpaceX to see if it is supposed to fetch a new build, and if one is available, it will download and apply the update during an ideal time that minimizes the impact on users. This means that engineers can easily test the build on a small pool and move to the larger deployments by changing a few configurations in a database. One Starlink asset can contain dozens of separate computers and SpaceX has designed its software system in such a way that each asset updates automatically by first fetching a new package to a central node and having all of the other computers fetch updates from that central node. Every device also retains a backup copy of the last good software, so that if anything goes wrong during the update, it automatically recovers by booting into that backup. So yeah, Starlink might not be as simple as an iPhone update, but at least it is smooth enough for you to barely notice. 3. System As you would expect, Starlink has a complex and intricate telemetry system. A telemetry system actually facilitates the data transmission between remote points over a network, which in this case would be the satellites and the fixed ground terminals. According to the head of application software for Starlink, the biggest challenge SpaceX ever had regarding fixed ground terminals is how to allocate satellite beams to every spot on Earth that they would want to serve. 2. Team The Starlink engineering team takes into account the field of view constraints, radio interferences from other satellites, including their own. Coming to its internet services, it works relatively well when moving. Christine added that motion generally does not add much complexity to the telemetry system. However, it presents some interesting challenges when it comes to satellites that are out of contract from the ground in parts of their orbit. 1. Starlink Starlink, SpaceX's next-generation satellite network, claims to have the potential of linking the world and providing dependable and cheap broadband internet access. To achieve this high aim, the firm launched a Falcon 9 reusable rocket laden with 6,500-pound flat-packed satellites. On May 23, the first of several launches took place. To offer a constant broadband internet connection, SpaceX aims to launch over 12,000 low-orbit satellites. Although comparable satellites currently exist, they circle the Earth at a height of 22,236 miles, resulting in a transmission latency of more than half a second. Starlink's growth appears to be quickening in 2021, following years of research inside SpaceX and the receipt of roughly $800.5 million in award funding from the Federal Communications Commission at the end of 2020. After approximately three years of successful launches, the project exceeded 1,000 satellites carried into orbit in January. Currently, SpaceX claims 1,800 satellites have been delivered into orbit. Well, that's about it for today. Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below. 
We will see you soon in another video. Until then, take care and goodbye.